Hi guys, Say Dot here, Dr. Cooper's with me. Hello it is again. time, hello, it is time to do something we haven't done for a while. It's an unboxing, you know that. You also know what unboxing it is, but this unboxing we haven't done for such a long time. The company closed, it's been taken over by a brand new team, and they are bringing out more pop and candy. If you don't know what pop and candy is, it is a box full of candy, and when you open it, it goes it doesn't. It's got a pop figure in it. Awesome. You know I love pop figures. You know he loves pop figures. You know we both love candy. So does he. Max is there. He's lying down and he's calm at the moment. And he gets too excited too quickly. As soon as we start rustling stuff, he's going to hear and he's going to wake up. But for now, he's calm. So shh, everyone. <laughs> We're going to open this box. It's freshly sealed, as you can see. Eh? Yeah, I could probably just do this better really than I'm doing it without ripping the box, but there we go, I've done it. It's open, we're gonna open up, we're gonna see what we've got. Ooh. Oh, there's, there's, there's polystyrene everywhere. There's a new, a new fancy postcard, this is cool. It's not the same as the old one. I like. It says, once you pop, you can't stop. Popandcandy.co.uk. You, you can't stop. And it's got on the back, you it's can't. got the UK's favorite pop mystery box. A mystery pop and a selection of brilliant candy each month, as we've said. No monthly subscriptions, and this is important. A lot of loot crate boxes and other companies like that and one up box and all those you you order it and each month they'll take the money out of your account regardless of whether you want to keep having them or not unless you tell them you want to cancel with pop and candy there is no that no no subscription you order when you want and at the end of the month they send you the box and that's it if you don't order again you don't get any more boxes you don't get charged anymore that's a good thing so there is the back of the postcard as I say links will be in the description um, for website stuff like that check it out get one and um, I think you can still get this particular month's box this is this is an early box because they know that I used to do videos for them they know that or for that company they know that I used to do stuff for them um we just stuff this back in the sofa after the dog's eaten it all <laughs> um right, I'm gonna put this just on the table for now and try and get it all out without oh without making the dog because <laughs> dog can't eat polystyrene that's not good for the dog at all at all, at all, at all, but it's okay. It expands in, in their his lungs. stomach and then in their lungs. Or whatever it and is then they will die. And we don't want that. The same with balloons. As much as Max is a pain in the bum, we don't want him to die. We don't want him to die. Oh, I saw a video today, just so you know. Um, um, I don't really see much of Diamond Minecart anymore, but one of his pugs has had to be put to sleep, which is very oh. sad. Um, a very sad day. So rest in peace, Peggy the pug. Um, hey. mm. His one wasn't very well, Peggy the Pug. I didn't even know yet. I yeah, had a the third one. last time I watched him, I only, he only had like. He had three for a two. while, but he didn't talk about her because she wasn't very well when they got her. Um, but yeah, she's been put to sleep, so that's very sad. But we love our dogs, all of us do. Everyone's got a dog, loves a dog. We've got Max, we've got Tonka, we've got the other Max. We have the cats. We have the cats, we've got three cats, three dogs between us all. And we've got a Jamie. The worst animal of them all. The right, we're this gonna start with good. we're gonna start with the drink because like. it's in a cat, it's in a bag. I like. This looks Haven't quite you cool. Haven't you had one of these, but you never opened it? But possibly, yeah. We're not gonna open it now either because I actually want this because I don't. You never used to drink any drinks, but I do now, so you're not having mm. it. Um, it is a can of duff. Duff. A can. I've got light. I've Ooh. got light reflecting. I'm sorry for the darkness. Again, it's it's bright outside, but this light room doesn't get a lot of light in it. I've got the living room light on. It's all weird. But anyway, there you go. We've got a can of Duff, Duff. Energy Drink. How awesome. Wonderful orange flavour. I will open that and I'll have it tonight probably, but it's going to be a, a Lucasady type orangey flavoured yeah, drink. There's something we are gonna, that you like in here. There is something, <laughs> definitely something I like in here. Whether they knew that. Again, they've probably watched, although it's a new team, they've probably watched my old unboxings and know that I like one certain item and you can probably guess if you want to guess now before I open that item or show that item put it in the comments now what you think the item is we're gonna start off with cow tails cow tails we used to have these didn't we Max likes these Max and Tonka like cow tails don't they we've actually got a cow tail where's the see if we can find a cow tail it's probably in the garden if not I was quite recently as I walked in did you? Is there a cow tail around there? Well, there's a real. This here is a real cow tail. This isn't a real cow tail. Oh, hello. 
cow tail. There you go. Give him his cow tail. Yeah, they're, they're cow dried cow cow's tails, and the dog's the dog loves them. He's done a little nibble here. <laughs> um, we're not going to eat all these. We're going to keep them. What we found, didn't we, in the past when we did these unboxings, like we used to do other food unboxings, that we'd take a nibble, and then they end up getting thrown away or half eaten. So we're just gonna we're just gonna show them. So there's a cow tail. <laughs> Excuse me. It's a strawberry flavoured cow towel. We like these, don't we? Yes. They're very nice. We like it. They're very nice. Um, yes, and we've got another one here. And Ooh, this is, oh, this flavor. is new. Oh, I'm mad to see before, I can't remember. Caramel apple, so like toffee apple if you're in England. Caramel apple if you're American. Um, cow tails. And these items are from around the world. A lot of American sweets, but not just American sweets. So that is a caramel apple. So we've got a strawberry and we've got a caramel apple flavoured cow tail. He's just got a cow flavoured cow tail. An actual cow tail. An actual cow tail. But between us we've got three cow tails. That's good. <laughs> that Let's have, nice. what, what's this? This. Go on then, show that then. What is it? A Belgian milk chocolate covered toffee. Oh, that could be quite nice, couldn't it? They make it focus there and we go. Yeah. This camera's got good focus, isn't it? They've got much my, better focus. It's better than mine. Mine's yeah, like really slow. My camera's a more expensive than yours. Isn't it? Like this is England's finest Walker's non such whack. Then unwrap and enjoy. Wow. So it is. So it is hard. It's a, it's, it's a hard toffee. Should we get a um, camera? Chocolate, camera? chocolate flavored <laughs> toffee. Awesome. Hammer. Very, smack very nice. Yes, just smack out the dog's head. It'll be fine. <laughs> the next item we're going to open is not open. We're going to show. It's called the Fifth Avenue. Now we've had these before, I think. Yes, and we've had. We had a few of these items. Yeah. yeah. Well, we've done enough of these unboxings, American sweet unboxings, to to have tasted a lot of them. And they're, they're never a bad thing though, they're never bad to have. Nope. This is a peanut butter enriched chocolate peanut coating. Butter. There you go. Fifth Avenue, crunchy peanut butter enriched chocolate coating. Very nice indeed. Fifth Avenue, it sounds like it should be a boy band or something. Um, I think it is. No. Be. One Direction you're thinking of. No, I'm not. I'm thinking uh, something different. Beatles. No. Oh, I know what it is. Westlife. No, it's boy like, zone. there's like three of them in it. It's like... Three Degrees? No. That's a girl group, but... It's like, oh, I can't remember what it's called. A1? They were on like Britain's Got Talent. Ah, yeah, Diversity. Or X Factor, one of them. Diversity. No, Susan it's... Boyle. <laughs> no. No? I don't know then. Is it Simon and Louie with Nicole Scherzinger? It's a back in, back in <laughs> No. With a boy suit on? No. Okay, I don't know then. Awesome. The next item is a trolley. Trolley, lolly, lolly. Trolleys. Trolley. Um, these are extreme sour bite fruits. Now, we've had these before. I think we had, yeah. we had these once at a, a mine venture. Yeah. I think we had them because Nettie doesn't do very well with, with the with the bean boozled, so I think we gave these to her to try <coughs> instead of instead of the bean yes. boozled. So there you go. Trolleys and they are chewy candy, extreme sour bite fruit flavoured. <coughs> very nice indeed. We're gonna go for the next item, the nerd rainbow rope. We've had definitely had these before. Um mm. they're like a chewy rope. I'm not a big fan of these, no, if I'm honest. Just... Um because they the, the, rope, the rope part part is nice, but I don't like nerds. I like the hard, crunchy things. But they're, they're not like a nice mix. No, but if you if you've had nerds before, you'll probably like them on their own. But whether you like it as a mix or not, soft chewy rope with the hard, crispy nerd shell on the outside, but still a nice thing to have, a nice thing to nibble on. A couple of nice things. In Two, that is three special. more items to go. Then we have the pop figure, which already I can see is awesome. And it's an really exclusive nice. as well. I'm very lucky with that. This next one is Snickers. You're used to Snickers in the UK. Um, this is that a peanut really butter nice. one though. Yeah, it does look nice actually. And it's actually got two two pieces, so we can have a piece each. Snickers. Two nuggets. Um, you are you are who you who are you when you're hungry? You're a diva when you're hungry. Am I? Yeah, I turn into Mr. Bean. What about Max? Just a knob. <laughs> Full stop. There you go. <laughs> Snickers peanut butter. There is that. If you haven't seen my Instagram, check out my Instagram post over the last couple of days. He took a little nibble out of the sofa. I'm and then sure. yesterday, he took a much, much bigger nibble out of the sofa. And now <laughs> there's hardly any stuffing left in the middle chair. I'm hoping it's fixed soon. We'll see. Um, Baby Ruth. This is one of my favourites. These oh, are okay. very, very nice. And again, no, they're in one piece, my friend, you can't have any. Okay, we've got, we've got a <laughs> we can share. Of nice we can cut. share. Baby Ruth. These are kind of... Baby it's, it's a It's peanuts, caramel, and nougat. It's kind nougat. of... Nougat. Nougat. It's kind of like a Snickers bar. Yeah. Kind of. Similar. A cross between a Snickers and a Milky Way. Snickers. Um, which is never a bad thing. There you Mine's go. Baby <laughs> Ruth. We have one item. Now, if you haven't guessed, this is your last chance. Don't cheat. This is your last chance to guess 
before I show it what you think this last uh, last food item will be, one of my favourites. Got five seconds. One. It's Jelly Belly. We've got a ten flavour Jelly Belly box. I don't share Jelly Bellies because they are my favourite. You're not a big fan, are you really? Yeah. He's not a big fan, as he's, just, <laughs> yeah. as he's just said, he's not a big fan at all. There are... Can I have a look? No. Are you sure? Yeah. They're the Jelly Bellies. And we have one more item to show. And this, we've had the candy. Now we've got the pop part. Pop. It's where it explodes. It is where it explodes. This is a Harry Potter pop. Harry now, weirdly, I've got two... Out of all, I've got like 200 odd pops now. And out of all the pops I've got, I've got two that I really say I would say I'm collecting, if you like. One of them's The Walking Dead. Um, and I've got probably 15 or so, 16 Walking Dead ones. Um, and then the other one is the Harry Potter ones. As I said, this is a Harry Potter one. And this is a Funko 2017 Summer Convention exclusive Luna Lovegood with glasses. How cool is that? This is limited edition. Ooh. It's really cool. It's a limited edition. So you can only get this if you, or you should really be able to get this if you've bought it from the Funko 2017 Summer Convention. So it's brand new, relatively brand new. We've got um, just the normal ones on the back. This is just a Harry, Fred, George. Oh, Bellatrix should be quite cool. Lucius Malfoy, Minerva McGonagall, Mad Eye Moody, and Dolores Umbridge um, in this in this section. But yeah, there we are. That is Luna Lovegood with funky glasses. He's got like the Elton John. Dame Edna Everidge 3D style glasses that the two colours on them, the pink and the blue or the red and the blue style as well. I really like that. And that will go into my collection as one of the Pride of Place ones because it's a limited edition. So there you go guys, if you want your own Pop and Candy box, head to popandcandy.co.uk. There is still time to order um, from in, in this month. I think I think the orders are still going up until, I think Pop and Candy are trying to do it, where you can order up until the last day of the month or the day before the last day of the month and they will guarantee your box goes out that month. It's a once a month thing, so if you order on the 1st, your order's gonna be dispatched at the end of the month. If you order on the 28th of the month, it's still gonna be dispatched at the end of the month. So depending on when you order, how long you have to wait. Um, they're shipping worldwide now, they've got international shipping, so you can order wherever you like in the world. Um, and yeah, in the UK, it's free shipping. Um, I think on top, there's gonna be charges for worldwide shipping, but still, um, if you don't get a chance to get sort of random pops, it's a random pop, you don't get to select the, the pop you get, it's a random one, you can get some exclusives like that, but either way, you're going to get a fantastic pop figure and um, some really cool candy. And hopefully, this will become a monthly box for us. We don't do many unboxings now, um, but the ones we do get are really cool ones. So thank you to Pop and Candy for sending that out early. And uh, me and Dr. Group will be back hopefully next month for next month's Pop and Candy. Cheers, guys. Bye. Goodbye.